The multi-scanner i521 step makes stud finding fast and simple. The i520 uses patented center vision technology to find the center of studs. The ultra bright display screen indicates direction, edges, and center of both wood and metal studs and joists. The tool has two scanning modes for regular walls with one layer of drywall and for walls with two layers. There are also modes for dedicated metal and AC electrical scanning. The i520 features a signal strength indicator which helps distinguish between shallow and deep targets and wire warning indication to warn you of potential live AC wires behind the wall. Here's how to use it. If scanning for studs or joists, switch the tool to stud scan mode. Place your multi-scanner i520 one step against the wall. Push and hold the power button. The word stud on the display screen confirms calibration. Slide it along the wall. As you approach a stud, when the tool is over either edge of the stud, the edge icon will be shown. The center of the stud will be indicated by the center icon, an audio tone, and the spotlight pointing system. Mark the center of the stud. If you happen to start over a stud and move away, the unit will self-correct and calibrate again on its own. An arrow on the display will indicate the direction of the stud. If you have problems finding any studs, or if you know you are scanning through material thicker than three quarters of an inch, switch the tool to stud deep scan mode. The stud icon will flash, indicating the tool is in high sensitivity mode. The center of deep studs will be indicated by the four middle bars. To find metal, switch the tool to metal finding mode. Press and hold the power button while holding the tool away from the surface to be scanned. Place the tool against the wall and begin scanning. As the unit approaches metal, the bars on the display will come together. Simply mark where you first get the strongest reading, reverse direction, and mark where the tool again shows the strongest reading. To narrow the results, place the tool on the wall near one of the marks. Turning the tool on closer to the metal target will recalibrate the tool to give you more accurate results. Scan the area and mark the edges of the strong signal just like last time. You'll get a smaller zone with the target still in the middle. You can do this repeatedly to further refine the search results. To confirm the location of the metal target, such as a pipe, Scan vertically. The tool should indicate a constant strong signal as you run along the pipe. Scanning for electrical follows a similar procedure. Switch the tool to AC scan mode. Place the tool on the wall and press and hold the power button. Scan for the AC wire. Mark the edges of the strongest results Turn the tool off and then back on closer to one of the marks and scan again for better results. The wire warning indicator alerts you to the presence of a potentially live AC wire in the vicinity of your scan. This feature is always on in stud and metal scan modes. Extra caution should always be taken in the presence of electricity.